Hello everyone, my name is Shelly Calhoun-Jones and I'm a Technical Marketing Director here at Cohesity. Today we're going to take a look at the data classification scanning feature in Cohesity Data Cloud. Let's get started. Clarity is not a luxury, it's a lifeline in the face of a cyber attack. Data classification provides that clarity. In one instance, an organization received multiple alerts from its SIM indicating encryption patterns that no one could explain. Within minutes, systems across the network began to lock up. Users reported disappearing files and crashing applications. Soon after, a ransom note appeared demanding payment or the risk of losing everything. Fortunately, this organization had strong security measures to assess the attack's impact. Data classification scans helped identify systems with sensitive data that needed immediate attention so they could quickly respond. Let's take a look at how this works in Cohesity. Data classification scanning can apply to both proactive and reactive scenarios. This information can help you refine your security policies. When creating a new data classification scan, you can choose a policy which uses pre-built patterns or create your own using regular expressions. You can also use predefined policies that utilize these patterns. For example, if you want to scan specific data types such as healthcare information, you can select the HIPAA policy or create a custom policy tailored to your needs. Let's return to the data classifications view to initiate a new scan. In this example, I'm searching for a server which is part of a larger workload. This server contains business and customer data. We'll choose a scan policy. On this screen, I'll choose the most recent snapshot and I can also give my data classification scan a name. Note that you can also set exclusions for things like non-sensitive content or compressed data. You could also choose to have the scan run on a particular cadence. Let me show you an example of the scan results. If I click on the entry, I can see specific data patterns that it triggered on, including credit card information. From here, I can determine whether or not the PII data should reside there or if we need to tighten the server's security policies. Another feature of Cohesity is the inventory feature, which you can use to assess risk from a centralized view. You can identify the current data protection status. You can also initiate scans directly from the inventory dashboard. By providing a consolidated overview, the inventory view helps you proactively reduce risk before an attack occurs, strengthening your cyber resilience. And this completes the demonstration. We took a look at the data classification scanning feature in Cohesity and how you can use it for proactive and reactive scenarios. Thanks for watching.